check out Chaos Cards for awesome prices and products. Rose here, and here is a Chaos Cards haul. I haven't done one of these for a while because the other things I've ordered came, like, you know, in single things that didn't actually you know, come together. But I have two boxes this time. I already opened them, I didn't look at them yet. But I opened them because obviously he's got my address on the outside. So, let's see what's in this first one. One thing. Okay. So here we have the awesome. Obviously, it's different packaging than the uh, U.S. I guess. I think. So pretty sure this in the U.S. this jumbo card was behind here. But anyway, that's still cool. Can you see the Legend of Johto GX collection box. Got Nente and Raiko uh, alternate art. So, as I was saying, without all the background noise. So, yes, so the Legends of Johto GX collection box, which is awesome, and I only had to pay for it with um, 21 pounds. And if you notice, the artwork on the box is the exact, like, kind of theme to the uh, legendary Pokemon um, distribution uh, page on the Pokemon website. You know, for all the uh, legendaries they're giving away for the 11 months or something. Anyway, the uh, uh, hashtag for the legendary thing is uh, hashtag be legendary. So that's, you know, the thingy. Anyway, the only thing I'm sad about is that they don't have a Suicune or a Suicune um, GX card. They have Raiko and uh, Entei, which is all oh, really good because I love Entei. Don't really like uh, Raiko that much, but still. Anyway, so you get five packs in here with, ooh, Primal Clash, yay. And you gotta break through or something. So, yeah. That's awesome. And I don't know why it has, like, this, uh, plasticky thing, because sometimes they don't have it, sometimes they do. But anyway, and that, that's that thing. So I just put that down there. And here... We have some things that I was waiting for. Let me just yeah. There's nothing inside there. And this was a heavy box. So inside we have the ooh he looks so cool. This is the uh Dusk Main Necrozma, or as I like to say, the uh Sogalio possessed. I'd say one of those tins I only have like you know two different ones. So there's the Sogalia one, and here's the Renal one. So I think I was waiting for these two because they were they ran out of stock pretty fast, even though I ordered this on the 15th of March. Anyway, so there we have those two. Then we have the lunchbox. I don't normally get these. The only the first lunchbox I got was the uh, Shining Legends one, which is over, over there. But um, yeah, I thought I might as well since you know I've gotten like everything so far of the Sun and Moon stuff. So and it is pretty awesome. You got all three Lycan Rock versions in the back. So you get Possessed Lunala and uh, there's probably a something down there. Anyway, yeah, so look forward to that. 
And see, oh yes, and these next ones eh, are not Pokemon for a change. We have part of the legendary collection or legendary decks. Um, what I've been collecting of Yu-Gi-Oh anyway. So this is the legendary deck, legendary collection Kaiba that was part of the legendary decks. This is like the number three or four in the set. Because I know there's legendary decks one and two. I think there was a Yugi one based one. Then there, this is the Kaiba based one. I can't remember anymore. But anyway, you get my draft. So if you follow any of my Yu-Gi-Oh openings, which I haven't opened a lot in a while, but uh, this is this. It's got a game board, five new ultra rare variant cards. Three legendary collection Kaiba Mega Packs, 30 foil cards, four secret rares, six ultra rares per mega pack. So that's awesome. So you get three stuff. Yes. Anyway. But now that I think about it, it might not be similar to the decks, it's similar to like the uh, legendary collection ones, like the Joey one that I opened before. Anyway, so that's that. And then we have a selection. I got a Extreme Force booster pack, and surprisingly, and it would actually cost quite a bit. It is the one of the first Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. I have opened one of these, but I only opened a Japanese one because it was cheaper at the time, and I didn't have any of these. But this is an English version that I can put with the rest of my pack arts, as well as this old school one, which is a spell ruler. These are like six or plus pounds each for summer. Then I have two, four, six, seven. So I think I, they only had seven available, so I had all seven of these spirit warriors. I'm trying to get that one card. I think it was Cloud Painter or something. I forgot. There was only one card I was missing in the ultra rare or the secret rares or something. And uh, I want to see if I can get it in these. So that is, I think that, that's it of uh, the stuff that I shall be opening. So like to, just to recap, there, is, there will be a video on I don't know if I should do two videos or just put it all in one. But we'll see how many. Oh, I'll only two. Uh, thing. I don't know. I might just do it all in one. But I am really I'm only looking for one card. It's kind of hard with the camera right next to me instead of in front of me this time. Anyway, so there's seven of these Spirit Warriors. Then, I might have like a special episode, one each, for this one at least. And for the blue eyes, or I can do both of them in one video. I don't know. Because these are the uh, very old ones. And obviously they are the unlimited version, not the first edition. Awesome! Then obviously I got one of these because I don't have a pack art of this yet. And I needed one for my pack art collection of stuff. Of Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. Anyway, then I'll be opening this one as well. I might spread out the Yu-Gi-Oh ones because obviously like in between the Pokemon ones. There we go. Then we've got the lunchbox. The uh, Dawn Wings Necrozma GX tin. Unleash the full power of the Eclipse. Dun dun dun. Mm, I like how they do this though. The energies at the bottom. Very pretty. Mm. And obviously, I'll be 
be opening this awesome, awesome collection box. So, that is everything that I am going to be opening. Bye. So, this is going to be fun. Because I, I actually ran out of things to open. So I need some stuff. So, this is going to be awesome. And I still have the Tapu Lele pin collection box to come because they don't know when it's going to be released. Because I pre-ordered it in December. And the date was set for July to March. And now I'm just set to delayed because they don't really know. But I did buy two of those. So look forward to that. Anyway, so thank you for watching. I'll do, you know, a picture of what's to come. Uh, over and out.